Hey guys, welcome back. Today I have a hair tutorial for you, which is a very rare thing to happen on my channel, but I am gonna share with you the look that I have today in the hair. It's the look that I've been wearing for the last couple months and it's super easy. And I'm gonna show you how to get volume this is good volume for me having fine hair <laughs> so I'm gonna be showing you that and not only is it gonna give you volume but it's actually really super easy to do it doesn't take a lot of time once you get the the routine down my hair is not really thin but it is very very fine it's very very slippery and it just does not like to hold a lot of volume so if you have fine hair and you want volume in a straight hairstyle that's what we're doing today and I will be using clip-in hair extensions to achieve this voluminous and straight hairstyle and they do give me a little bit of length but more so they give volume and that's what's great about the brand I'm using the brand Beauty Works they have a ton so many products to choose from you're gonna be able to find the length and also the color that matches you best now I love the fact they have I think they start at 16 inches and they go up to 20 or 22 inches so if you're just looking to achieve volume it's really hard to get a shorter length in other extension brands that I've noticed because a lot of them are only 20 inches or 22 inches which is great but if you just want to add volume and not necessarily length then you're kind of paying more than you need to because you're getting such long 22 you know etc inches of hair so if you want to see how i did this hair how i got tons and tons of volume for a fine haired girl then just keep watching all right so this is my natural hair i don't have anything in my hair no extensions or anything this is what we're working with and i did go ahead and just let my hair air dry last night and then I just went to sleep on it. So this is how I wake up. Now, I don't really need to go in with a flat iron to straighten out my hair. I'm just gonna go with it as is. But if you do have wavy hair or your hair just doesn't dry as, as straight as mine does, then go ahead and just flat iron your hair. That's all you need to do and then you'll be caught up and ready to move on to the next steps. What I've already done is I went ahead and applied some dry shampoo and I used the Batiste Dry Shampoo Cool and Crisp Fresh. So I just sprayed that in all over and even though my hair was clean from washing it last night I like dry shampoo just because it helps add a little bit of texture and it also helps the clips of the clip-in extensions to grip on a little bit more now I'm gonna be using two different sets of extensions which I know sounds really crazy and you absolutely don't have to use two you can use just one but I'm gonna tell you why so the first set that I'm gonna use comes like this and this is just the Beauty Works deluxe clip-in hair extensions so this is 140 grams it's only three different pieces which makes life so much easier that's why I love these extensions because it's only three pieces 140 grams of hair so it's less time clipping them in and taking them out every day it makes it so much easier and it helps me want to to use them more often because it's just not as much work as different sets of extensions that have maybe like 10 pieces 8 to 10 pieces which is like insane so the color I have in case you're wondering is number t3-6 and it's 18 inches so i'm not going to be adding a ton of length maybe just like a an inch maybe two inches but obviously what we're going for here is volume so this is the deluxe clip in set you get three different pieces you get one three clip weft that looks like that and i also love how it's the balayage or balayage 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 <laughs> and it's just so it's so natural it's not super one color and then light and bright at the bottom it's really subtle and really just natural and that's what my hair is so that's why these look so good and so natural so there is that first one you get and then you do get two of the four clip wefts that look like that and then for an extra wham bam impact of volume I'm gonna be using this this is called the quadruple weft so as you can see it has actually four different wefts of extension sewed together in one weft with four clips so this is going to give so much more volume and this is 70 grams just in itself so this is going to really give you extra volume so much extra volume with only four clips and so that's what we're all about and this is the pack that this one comes in in case you're curious so this is number four over six so it is not the exact same color but it's 
pretty darn close. You don't have to use both, you don't have to use the quadruple weft, but because this is a voluminous <laughs> hair tutorial, that's what I'm gonna be sharing with you, just an option. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and brush my hair out, even though I already did that after I dry shampooed, just to make sure there's no tangles. And then I'm gonna just start sectioning my hair and clipping them in, and to section and hold up my hair, I'm gonna be using this little, is this an alligator clip? But I like it because it has little rubber nubby type things in there, so it really helps hold my fine, slippery hair in place so it doesn't slide out. So I really love that, and I'm pretty sure that's like by the brand Goody. And for the first section, I'm just gonna start kind of at the middle of my ear right here, and then just make a part, clip it up, and then I'm just gonna go ahead and back comb a little bit just to add extra grip for the clip-ins. You don't have to do back combing or anything like that if you don't have really fine hair, but because I have really fine hair, I just am more happy and I feel more secure with the clip-in extensions when I back comb a little bit. Now I'm just going to go ahead and add the rest of the extensions. I am going to go in with the quadruple weft next just to put most of that volume and hair towards the bottom just so it's going to be a little bit more undetectable that way and just look more natural and blend more naturally with, with your natural hair. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and I'm just going to work in little increments above each extension. All right, so I have all the clip-ins in, and I'm just gonna take a brush and really lightly and gently brush through just to blend everything together. And I kind of like to put a little pressure up here to hold the clip and brush out that way. Not because they're gonna fall out, but because I just don't like yanking on my head. You know, that clip-in is on your natural, clipped into your natural hair. You just wanna be really careful. Let me go ahead and show you the back view. And now that we have massive volume down here, I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit more up top. So I'm gonna take my L'Oreal Boost It High Lift Creation Spray, which I love. This just really amps up that volume and just gives you fantastic volume. I am gonna be back combing or teasing just a little bit, just to, just what I like to do, add a little bit more volume. I find that it lasts longer that way. I know some people don't like back combing, but if you're gently, if you're gently with it, if you're gentle with it, I don't think it's a big deal, at least I don't think so. And by the way, the the brush that I really love for back combing is this one. This is by the brand Goody, and it just looks like that. It just really is amazing for back combing or teasing fine hair. And I think it comes in a set with this guy as well. I will list it and link it below for you. I'm pretty sure it's a set. I just like to start kind of back here, and I'm gonna take that spray and spritz it right on the roots there, and then just start gently back combing. 
just gonna take more sections. This is really personal preference. Some people like to tease a lot, some people just tease a little. I think I'm a moderate teaser. <laughs> and I find that the smaller sections you take, even though it takes longer to do, it lasts longer for me. And so that completes your look. Just kidding. So now I'm just gonna kind of comb down a little bit with my fingers and then I just go in with a brush and just lightly smooth it out. Go ahead and part it. I like to do a middle part pretty often because I have these little, these little baby hairs. Look at those. They've been there ever since I was a little girl. And so when I do a side part, it just doesn't look good. It looks like I'm balding because they're just like, see, little baby hairs. So that's why I do a middle part. I've gotten a couple questions about why I always do a middle part. Because I'm trying to work with what I got. So yeah, just kind of smooth over, just really lightly because you don't want to really brush out that teasing that we just did. And you could go ahead and finish it off with hairspray. Sometimes I do, but sometimes I don't just because I feel like when I add hairspray, I just brush it out anyway. So I don't know. That's a definitely a preference. I like the soft touchability of it without hairspray. And then I like to go back in with this little pointer and just kind of stick it in there and poof it up. All right guys, so that is basically the look. That is what I've been doing with my hair in pretty much all my videos that you guys have seen. And just look how natural they look. I just love the color of these. Like I said, it's just such a subtle, beautiful and natural looking balayage or ombre. Do they call it balayage or ombre? Anyway, it's just really, really natural and I really love it. The fact that these extensions have such a long width of hair on each weft, it makes it so easy to clip them in. You don't have to worry about extensions with one clip or two clips. It just makes it so, so much easier. I'm going to go ahead and link all the products that I talked about for you guys. And I do have a 10% off coupon code for Beautyworks for any purchase with, with free shipping. So that's awesome. So I'll leave that below, of course. And yeah, so that is the tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.